this video I'd quickly like to show you um, your control panel as the app developer. Um, the idea is you can add your clients here, you click add user and then you'll give your uh, new user a, a username, email, password, then you'll put in the app ID that you've uh, attached to their app when you created the app, that'll be in your control panel um, of the app development platform that you use. Um, one for Android, one for iPhone and one for iPad. Um, you can always come back and change these uh, later. So if we give um, uh, a quick username, Subi, excuse me, this create. Uh, Now again, these app IDs um, I've just made up, but you'll get yours from your uh, control panel, as I said, in your development platform. Um, once you've done that, you just click register and it will say new user is added. You'll be able to see them here. If you click edit users, you'll see the new user here. If you want to edit any of her details, just click on the edit button and you can edit any of the details. Once the new user is added, um, then your client can log in and uh, uh, send push notifications whenever they want. We'll come in uh, back to that later. Um, <clears throat> you can also change your password that logs into uh, your push note server account here. Um, on add edit app ID, this will be um, to put your um, app developer ID that you that you have with your app development platform and also the password that you use to log into that platform. Uh, push note server doesn't log into your um, platform at all but it requires those details in order to uh, send the push notifications through your apps. Um, here on message we've got a very cool feature. Uh, this is so that you can brand the welcome page that your clients see when they log into their push note server control panel. Um, you can put a, a message, you then can upload a, uh, an image and you can put your business name and then just click add message and it will appear in your clients uh, control panels that will come to in a minute. Um, there's a help page here and of course you just click log out when you're finished adding your clients or, or reviewing them. Okay, that's it for this video. Thanks very much.